All right, despite popular belief, I'm not lost. Okay, uh, we, I'm a lot closer than I thought I was. I think this is Cody's base. And if this is Cody's base, that means Cannibal's base is just past that. Which also means we're not too, too far from my base. And I have the coordinates from my base now. We're not getting lost, ever. Well, we can't get lost, but we'll, we'll always know how to get home. And the coordinates are, let me just, how about, 1536-8794. Oh, so we're actually like, oh, we're a good like thousand blocks away. <laughs> okay. What, what is this? Jerry the Baby Skeleton, where are you? Oh, Someone have a baby skeleton that broke loose? That looks like a throne type thing. Did Cody build like landscape? Yeah, I hear lava. Oh, it's that thing making noises. Whatever a silex is. Never heard of it before. Can we... Okay, we can... Can we just... What? You can actually have like apple trees. I think we have an orange tree at ours. Interview Durr, the haunted castle. Oh, oh, it's an attraction. It's part of his, uh, part of his, uh, what's him called? His park. Yeah, after after we explore the, his park and Cannibal's park, we're, we're going back to mine. We've got a load of new pens and a load of new dino eggs. We've got like all those dino eggs that we stole from Kraken. We. We turned them into eggs. Or the DNA we stole, we turned it into eggs. What's that? It's got four culture vats. Oh, hello. What, what was that? Was that? It's a water dino. I don't have any water dinos. Not yet, anyways. What do you got in here? Is that an ostrich? Why have you got an ostrich? What? This is- you're meant to have a dino park. How would it be an ostrich? Oh wait. It's called desert. I can't tell if that's a T-Rex or Spinosaurus or what, so I'm just gonna remove myself <laughs> in case it attacks. Oh! Rip Jerry the baby skeleton. Okay. We keep seeing signs about Jerry. Oh, that's an actual T-Rex! Okay, let me out! Let me out! Let me out! It, uh, no! Okay. Okay, it was actually chasing me. What is wrong with that horse? Whoa. Oh, Chocobo. Oh, Jenny. And the... Okay, that must be Jerry the Skeleton. Samoa. I'm just gonna... Yep. I don't wanna fight with you, Skeleton. Oh yeah! That's right! I gotta go back and do a sign! We're doing the first sign of the day today. Oh. Oh. Go away. Go away. How do we get... How do we get out? Oh. Go up. <laughs> Forgot there was a basement. Get out, old gadoodle! What's in here? Caesar. Whoa! Okay, he attacks. He attacks. He attacks. That's not very safe. Up here. Oh. Pretty neat. Not bad. Not bad at all. I can't... Yep. There it is. I knew it. I knew it! Of course, Carnival's building literally a one to one skill replica of the visitor center in Jurassic Park. Look at this! Okay. We have a lot of catching up to do. 
What are all these? He's got visitors. Are these all subscribers? That's a that's a pretty cool idea. Got the visitor center of all all the subscribers. Okay, what? You can't. You stay in there. Okay. Take your dang spino. Okay, that wasn't meant for me then. They don't look like dinosaurs. <laughs> Centaurs. Was oh, he got a water dino? Nope, just some silaxes. What about this? He's got a water di water dino over here. Nope, just some sil. What? He's got a slider. What is this? Hey, okay, you can't get in yet. Does it move? Okay. Oh, there's an aether portal. All right, we gotta go home. We gotta find our way home, and uh, make some progress. We got these three. Oh, it's done. I literally put that in there like five minutes ago and it's done. Why is it? Is it just, is it random how long it takes? I, I, I have no clue. No. Uh. Oh, and we just got another one. That literally perfect. Put that in there. We're not going to need two, two of them. Also, we don't even have a cage built for a flying bird yet. Whoa, what was that? Okay. Run the fire! Run the fire! Where is he? He's in my fields! He's in my farm! Get him! Yeah, walk in that cactus, boy! I can see your gun! The cactus is doing all the work! This is... Easiest boss battle of my life. <laughs> Let me get one look at your face. Good night! God bless. Gone, but not forgotten. Okay. Uh, our Spino, is he still in here? I can't quite see him. The enclosure's not the best. You can't actually see anything through the enclosure. Oh, yep, he's in the water. But has he gotten bigger? He's gotten bigger. He's not 100% a baby anymore. It says, it says he's a baby, but he's definitely not a baby. Oh, we got our baby Ankylosaurus. <gasps> a Brachiosaurus has grown. Oh, yeah, he's grown. And also look at the size of his enclosure now. It's, it's not, still not the biggest, but it's big enough for him for now. Consciously didn't put too many trees, or tall trees, in case he gets too big and he has nowhere to roam about, so we left that part over there open. We give him some water. Uh, the Ankylosaurus doesn't have any water yet, because we we, do, we had to repair his old his whole uh, enclosure, because a meteor hit it. As you, did you see in the last video? I'm not too sure if you saw in the last video. How did you even get in there? You touched my dinosaur and I'll, I'll, I'll kill you. You don't even have a mouth. Oh, and these are two new enclosures for our uh, little Ceratosaurus and our Gallim Gallimimus. Gallimimus. We're calling them Mimus. Actually, no. No. You guys get the name. You guys get the name the dinos. We need a name for our Spino. We need a name for our We need a name for our Brachiosaurus. We need a name for... Are you trying to attack me? No. Okay, and we need a name... Or our Ceratosaurus. Everyone who names them, I'm gonna pick. You gotta, you gotta com leave a comment in the, in the comment section below with a name and your username, and I'll leave. You know what? I'll do one better. Instead of having a sign, I'm gonna have. I'm gonna, I'm gonna create an NPC of you being the enclosure keeper. Okay. So basically, you're just gonna have an NPC standing outside the enclosure with your name, and it's gonna be your job, pretty much, basically. Oh. There we go. Didn't have any doors, so I just used ladders. I see you. I see you! You're very loud. Let's go on nighttime. Always. Every time I make an episode, it goes nighttime. Probably. I have a torch. Okay. Gallimimus? I don't know what either of those two dinos even look like. To be honest. Hi the. What? There we go. And our last dino. Yep, you guessed it. 
We got ourselves a water dino. He's called. Uh, oh, it's, I I don't know how. He, Lyoplerodon. Then he's got a load of fishies on a horse seat. I don't know how the horse got in there, but he did. Also, how am I going to get in? I didn't think this one through. I don't have any. Don't have any more ladders. This sand will have to do. Apparently, these dinos spawn instantly as soon as they touch the water. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rethink how I'm gonna do this. Pick up all the sand. It'd be easier for me to just break a, break a hole in the glass, and then repair the glass with the sand. Just turn the sand in the glass and repair it. You know. Okay. Uh. We're going in. Hey, everybody! Hopefully no fishies get dragged out that hole. Oh, no. Okay. And place him here. Place him. Oh, there we go! Ah! He ate me! And we're not even at home! Oh, we gotta travel the whole way home again. I didn't think baby's, baby's dino was attacked, but I was wrong. I was very, very wrong. Oh, and it's night time. When we get back, when we get back home, we're sleeping. That's our next next objective. Woo! Honey, we're home. Oh no, the bed's not up there, it's up here. Okay, we have to go up this way though. Okay, no, get your way, I have to go! See if I... I don't have much health! I can't... I can't die. I can't die. Let me sleep. Yes, please. Sleep. Set spawn. Yes! Okay. Whoop. Our last objective is quickly repair this glass and call it an episode. Boom. Where is he? There he is! Yeah, I think he's... He should have plenty of fish to feed on. See? Oh! He's an absolute savage! He's murdering all them fish! They're not even gonna last 24 hours! Why is there a hole? Okay, it doesn't matter, I'm just gonna... Uh... Gonna hide in here with this giant moth! Why is there a giant mo It's a butterfly. Okay, we're good. I don't mind butterflies. I thought it was a moth. Hey. Even butterflies don't want to be my friends! 